So the concept for the shoot today was really about being able to create natural functional hair. I mean, I had a sort of mishmash of references, which were people like Julia Margaret Cameron, a dear friend of mine, David Cho, who loves to, to work with hair and his artwork. And I think I just wanted to sort of see how we could mash it up together. I, I didn't always plan to be a hairdresser. My parents were very much like, you know, you need to get your education, you need to sort of focus on that. And I said to my father that, you know, I wanted to go to art school. And he was like, well, what artists that are alive make any money? One of the biggest questions that, that, that women ask is, you know, oh, my hair condition is so dry or it lacks volume. And it goes down to the roots of that, you know, and then, excuse the pun, but it's literally like going to the scalp and finding out what's going on there. I am a huge fan of a French product called Lionel Grey. They've used an awful lot of technology with plant science and a lot of the products basically trying to replenish what, what hair does naturally. The thing that always sticks in my mind was probably the day that I went to um, Bob Marley's house. And it was for me somewhere where, when I lived in New York, I used to spend an awful lot of time in Jamaica and being a Rasta, it was like home from home. And so this was like, you know, an iconic moment because all I could do was like, I'm sitting in Bob Marley's bedroom. So, you know, <laughs> stop yourself. I really, really, truly believe that, you know, no one knows it all. It doesn't mean that we haven't seen it before. And I think there's a lot of great, interesting young talent that's coming out of, um, you know, colleges, coming out of like, salons and stuff like that. But it's really quite incredible when you see something from somebody that just is naturally gifted. Um, and if you could go back in time and give some advice to your younger self, what would you say? Just listen to your dad. <laughs>